What's going on everyone, XN Shardex here from NTP, and I'm back again with another Hermitcraft member. Uh, today, uh, we have Zisuma, or Zisuma Void. Um, this is a, another YouTuber, you know, part of the whole group. He's still with him, he's there from the beginning. He's also the Doom guy. I like this guy a lot, just for his skin. Um, so, really cool skin. If you don't know the Doom guy, he's the main, char he's the main character you play in the game Doom. If you don't know that game... Uh, don't play it till you're older, kids, because I wouldn't recommend yeah, you guys playing Doom. Unless you're into, like, scary games and stuff, then, you know, by all means. And if your parents are, like, cool with it, you know, if you played it before, then good for you. I still haven't played it. I want to. But, um, yeah. But, <laughs> yeah, this guy's YouTube channel is in the description. And, of course, the link to the uh, original video where we made all these guys in one go. Um, that's in the description as well. We're, we're halfway through the first row. Check it out. We're almost there. So, yeah, we're getting close. But, all right, let's just jump into this and get this over with, this quick, easy tutorial. Um, so, dimension time. The legs here are 8 by 4 by 12. The torso here is 8 by 4 by 12. And the arms are attached or aligned to the torso, and they are 4 by 4 by 12. And the head here is 8 by 8 by 8 with a head effect. As you can see, the mouth comes out one in the front, and the uh, head comes out one on uh, top, and that's it. Nothing on the back sides, nothing. So uh, there you go. But um, yes. So and those dimensions are linked by width, by height, and we in the description. And as usual, um, at the very end, um, there will be pictures in the plastic texture pack. So um, if I go by this really fast, which um, I will, because I'm I've done a lot of these, and I just want to be done at this point. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just want to burn through this. Um, then yeah. Uh, check those out to uh, help you. And if you know you know, you know that the pictures are probably the best thing for you to do, then just jump to the end. So, uh, you know, I'm done all rambling and stuff. But, you know, stick around. I'll just go through all this. So, materials, everything. Uh, detail time. Uh, for the legs here, the feet. Um, so you can see, like, pretty much the top half of his legs for, like, the pants-ish. It's like a uh, lime with a detailing and outline of green. And then the legs there are uh, oak wind planks. Um with, a, in fact, oak wood there in the very middle with a detailing of uh, spruce wooden planks and then the very bottom there, kind of, uh, with birch uh, wooden planks. Come right here at the side. Uh, same thing, majority of it is, in fact, lime with a little bit of uh, outlining of uh, green. And then you just have uh, oak wooden planks with uh, spruce uh, wooden planks. And around right here in the back, uh, these colors all just wrap around. In fact, you can see here that the lime and the green and the oak wood and the spruce wood, all of that just wraps around. You know, there's no difference, just wrapping around all the way. So, it's just lime, green, oak wood, and spruce wood planks. Wrapping all the way around here. And then this side of the legs is the exact same as the other side of the legs. So, uh, just go ahead, you know, and just mirror that right across. Um, and so here is the front of the, uh, front of his body, which is probably the hardest part, to be honest, or it's the most detailed, I should say. Um, obviously, his suit is a uh, lime with uh, detailing of green, like outlinings and stuff. Um, his belt there, or I guess you could consider it a belt, it's a spruce wood, or spruce wood planks with oak wood planks, and then birch wood planks. You also have oak wood planks going around uh, his arms there, um, and then his arms are sand. And then um, he's got uh, gray gloves. On. So, uh, yes. There is that. <sighs> I'm sorry, everyone. I'm doing this really late. It's really, I'm really tired. So, yeah, all these colors just wrap around here. The green, the lime, the sand, the uh, oak wood planks, and the gray. All that just wraps around here um, until you get to the back. Then it changes up a little bit. Um, it's actually a little bit different from the front. It's just right here changes. I thought it might be the same, so I went back and checked. But, um, all right. So, less colors here. But uh, still, a little bit, quite a little bit of detail. Uh, gloves don't change; they're just gray. His suit, you know, the thing he's wearing, it's still just uh, a lime with a green outlining or detail. Um, the sand is still in the same place, but it gets a little bit different here with the uh, the oak wind planks there, because it comes out a little bit. He's also got a little, a little bit more oak wind planks there for the belt um, on the back, as you can see. Um, that's it. So I'll just show that from like a, a slowly rising position. You can pause the video at any point you need to uh, assist you. So there you go. 
then you know obviously these these colors just kind of wrap up to the top and they touch each other so there you go but um, all right now it's time for the face so um, or i guess the helmet the front of the helmet um there's the face part of the helmet the visor there you can see it's all purple majority of it is in fact stone with some uh, gray uh, detailing around that and then a light gray you can see at the front of that that's uh, coming out is uh, just a little stone square with light gray going around it. That's the part that's coming out. Um, yeah, I mean... Uh, excuse me again. Uh, side here. It's pretty much all uh, stone on the side here. And uh, a little bit of gray and light gray. Mostly just stone, though. But uh, there's that. And then here's the back. Even though it's kind of poor... Uh, seeing it, it's just a light gray pattern here on the back, as you can see here. I know Unhost is kind of like in the way. Uh, but um, it's just light gray there on the very back of him. The rest of it is completely stone. Um, so, yeah, and you can see there's a little bit gray here. Wraps around from the top, but I'll get to that in a second. Uh, but yeah, this side is exactly the same as the other side. I'll just go ahead and show it real fast. Also, I didn't say it down here, but both arms are the same. I yeah, I know I didn't mention it, but that's kind of a uh, a given. But uh, yes, both sides of the head here are exactly the same. Just uh majority of it, again, is just stone with uh, gray and light gray. I'll go ahead and give you a second to pause the video if you need to check that out. So there you go. And here's the very top uh, with just this, these uh, two gray bands uh, going along the sides here all the way to the back. And then he just has like this... Uh, this four wide stone, just, you know, line going all the way to the back of his head. And then after you fill all that in and add that, uh, hat effect popping out the top, uh, you are done, uh, with this guy. So, that's it. We're just about done. Like I said, halfway there. Got three left. So, uh, yeah, let's do this, everyone. But, um, if you have any requests, leave in the comments, of course, for any other guys, any other, uh, maybe Hermitcraft members, of course, that, uh, weren't included in this so uh, that's a big big one to add but uh that's it for me guys uh so thank you for watching and as always i will see you for the next one mm -hmm.